Welcome one more time to the class, students. I'm really, really happy to see you here today. Have something new. I'm going to show you here the classroom presentation tool. Everybody, open, open your books, please. And let's start with the class. Let's start with our lesson. Oh, yeah, that's it. That's it. Let me see. Let me check. I'm going to activate this tool. I'm going to activate this option. Well, you know, students, the previous class, we were working on the unit number five. So I'm going to open here the unit number five, okay? We were learning about uh, some words, right? Uh, some body parts. Do you remember the body parts? Oh, dear. One moment, please. Oh, that's it. No? Here, the body part, for example, you have a... Um, Mouth, eye, head, ear, arm, hand, leg, foot, right? Today so we were learning about the use of this E for singular, not this is my head, plural, these are, these are my hands, right? So let's see the next part, we're learning new vocabulary about skeleton, hair, body, face, no? Then we were learning about the use of he has, para indicar que él tiene, right? He has the black hair, no? O negative, he doesn't have or she doesn't have. Ella no tiene o él no tiene, right? Doesn't have, no? Half tiene, doesn't have, no tiene. Okay, well, then we were learning the sound. Do you remember? This is my finger, I point to my nose. These are my feet, these are my toes. Wave your arms around and around, not your head up and down. No, do you remember? Yeah, right, it is the sound that we were learning. Then we were talking about the vocabulary part. Do you remember? The vocabulary about uh, the the sound of the k, queen, er, rabbit, sofa, t, table, a, uh, umbrella, right? Now it's time to talk about something new, students. I want you to see this part. This is lesson seven, video activity one. Watch and match, write the numbers, okay? Now. In this part, we have to do something, okay? We have to do something. Let me see. I'm going to activate this tool. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, you're going to watch the video soon and then you're going to match. What says here? No, activity one. Uh, sorry. Uh, in number one, we have the name Shiven. Number two, Marcel. Number three, Caitlin. Number four, Juan. You're going to watch the video and you're going to tell me who talks about each of these uh, images, pictures that we have on this part, right? For example, uh, who is gonna talk about this photograph? Shivan, Marcel, Caitlin, or Juan? What about this other photograph? What about this or this? We have to write the numbers, yeah? So first, you're gonna watch the video. Look, here we have many colors, right? Oh, look at these hands, very big. Look at the head, a big head, right? Oh, look here, a big nose, a big nose, right? Look, these are, or oh, the, uh, this person has a very big head, right? And he's holding the head with the hands, with the hands, he's holding the head, right? Now, look at these eyes. Oh, these eyes are green, green eyes. A big mouth, oh, big mouth, right? The dragon. Okay, well, I'm gonna watch the video, students. I'm gonna play this. One moment, I'm gonna stop the backing truck music and let's start with the video. I'm Juan. Hi, Shivan. Hello. Shivan, look at this photo. Is this in India? Yes, it is. The men are at a festival. 
please tell me about this photo? Okay, this is a photo of four men. The men have big heads. Their faces are red and yellow. They have big eyes. Their eyes are black and white. And their hair? Well, they don't have hair. They have yellow flowers on their heads. Tell me about their bodies. Well, the men have big heads on their own heads. I can see their legs and feet. Their arms hold the heads. The heads are very big. Yes, the men have strong arms. Hello, Marcel. Hi. Look at this photo. This is in Brazil. Yes, it is. It's at Carnival. What can you tell me about this photo? This is a woman. She has a big head. She has a big white face. She has red hair and a red mouth. And her eyes? She has big black eyes. She has a white nose. And her hands? Are her hands white? No, they aren't. I see one hand. It's brown. Caitlin, I have a cool photo. Look, it's from China. Ooh, yes, it's a dragon. Can you tell me about the dragon? Yes, this dragon is colorful. It has a big head. Its eyes are green. Its nose is white and black, and his mouth is white, green, and red. Does it have something in its mouth? Yes, it does. It has a ball in its mouth. Hello, Juan. Hello. Look at this photo. Is it in Mexico? Yes, it is. Tell me about this photo. Well, he has a big yellow mask. I can see his head, his hair, and his ears under the mask. Tell me about the mask. It's a big yellow head. And its mouth? It has a big mouth. Its mouth is red and black. But its hair is my favorite. Yes, it has cool hair. Okay, now this is going to be open microphone and you're going to tell me the answer, okay? So, let's start one moment. I'm going to move this. Okay. That's it. So, please, uh, you tell me, please, what number is this photo? Who talks about this photo? Shivan, Marcel, Caitlin, or Juan? Marcel. 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 That's right. Very good. Marcel, right? Marcel talks about this photo. To Marcel. Yes. Tell me, what color is the woman's face? What color is he, her face? Mm -hmm. White. White. Very good. White. 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 Excellent. White. It's white, right? She has a white face. And what color is the girl's hair? What color is her hair? Mm -hmm. Red. Oh, great, Red. no? She has a red hair, right? White red hair. hair. She has a white face and she has a red hair. Very good. Now, who talks about this photograph? Who? Shivan, Marcel, Caitlin, Juan? Juan. Juan. Very good. Juan, four. right? Number, number, number four. four, Juan. Very good. Number four, Juan. That's correct. And tell me, 
What color is its face? What color is its face? Yellow. Yellow. Oh, it has a yellow face, yellow. right? Oh, very good. Now, uh, what color is its hair? What color is Pink. it? Pink. Pink. Very good, right? Purple. Pink. Pink or purple, maybe? Okay. Pink yeah. or purple. That's, right. That's correct. Now tell me, what number is this photograph? Shiban. Shiban. Oh, very Shiban. good. She number one is the photograph. photograph. Excellent. Number one, Shiven, right? And now tell me, what color is the man's face? What color is it? Why? Why? What color is it? The face. What color is the face? The man's face. Bro. Red. Excellent, no? Red. Yes. Red. He has a red, red <laughs> hair, right? And now, does this man have a hair? Yes or no? No. Oh, no. 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 How, <clears throat> how do we say? He has hair or he doesn't have hair? He doesn't have hair. Excellent. He has hair. doesn't have, right? No tiene hair. He doesn't have hair. <clears throat> now tell me about the, the head. Does this person has a big head or a small head? What do you think? No big head. Big head. No Oh, very good. Tell me complete. He has. Tell me complete. He has a big head. He okay? has a big head. Excellent. No, he has a big, a big head. That's right. That's correct. Now, what number is this photograph? Kathleen. Oh, number very three good. is Kathleen. Oh, Kathleen, right? Kathleen, number three, Kathleen, okay? She talks about the dragon. Oh, that's right. Now tell me, what color are the dragon's eyes? Green. Green. Green teacher. Mm, very good. They are green. Oh, the dragon has green eyes. Now tell, tell me about the dragon's mouth. Uh, it has a big mouth or it has a small mouth? A small mouth. Big mouth. Big mouth. Big mouth. Oh, big mouth. Big mouth. Big mouth. Big mouth. Yeah, it has big a big mouth. mouth. Yes, that's right. In a big mouth, para que bote fuego, para que bote fire. Yeah? Now let's go to the next part, students. This is activity two. It says your turn. Now it's your turn, students. Ask an answer. The question is here, for example, what color are your eyes, no? He look at the eyes and he says they are brown. Now I'm going to ask my friend Alejandro Matias. Excuse me, Alejandro. What color are your eyes? They are brown. This, my eyes is brown. Okay, tell me complete, Alejandro. They are, because it's in plural, they are, right? They are, my eyes is brown. Okay, but you say my eyes are, remember, is for singular, are for plural, okay? My yes, eyes the... are, a ver, Alejandro. My eyes are brown. 
Excellent. That's right. My eyes are brown. Very good, Alejandro. Now I'm going to ask Kiara. Excuse me, Kiara. What color are your eyes? They, they are brown. Oh, excellent. Now, Kiara, you ask uh, Fabricio. Say, excuse me, Fabricio. Ask the question, please. Excuse me, Fabricio. What color are your eyes? Mm -hmm. Excellent. Fabricio? Answer, please, Fabrizio. What color are your eyes? My day, uh, my day brown. Okay, one more time, Fabrizio. They are brown. brown. They are. They are brown. They are brown. That's correct. Now, Fabrizio, you ask Alejandra Tello. Say, excuse me, Alejandra Tello. What color? A ver. Vamos, Fabricio, ask the question. Fabricio, vas a preguntar a Alejandro. A ver, Fabricio. Where is Fabricio? My day are bro. Ok, pero tienes que preguntar a Alejandro. Excuse me, Alejandra. What color? Aquí está the question. What color are you? A. Eyes. Repeat, Fabricio. What color are your eyes? A ver. What color are you? Okay. Eyes. Now, Alejandra, tell you, please answer the question. What color are your eyes, Alejandra? They are brown. Excellent. Very good. Thank you very much, Alejandra Tello. Now, let's continue to the next part, yeah? Here says activity three, draw and say. We are going to draw here. Vamos a dibujar. Draw, draw and say. What are we going to draw here? We are going to draw a friend, yeah? Vamos a dibujar a un friend, no? For example, I'm going to draw this friend here. Yeah, yo sé que ustedes lo van a dibujar mucho más bonito. Yo lo voy a hacer a manera de referencia. Okay. This is my friend. Uh, okay. The potato boy. And now I'm going to do something here. I'm going to do something here. One moment. And that's it. And that's it. Okay. You're going to draw it better, yeah? Ustedes lo van a dibujar better. Un friend. Vas a dibujar a tu friend, yeah? Now that's it. Okay. I'm going to draw here. This is my friend, for example, Pablo. Okay. This is my friend Pablo. Tú puedes dibujar a otro friend. No hay problema. También puede ser una girl, una amiga, friend, yeah? Eso depende de ti. For example, in this case, this is my friend Pablo. I'm going to write here, he has, okay, he has green eyes. Oh, you finish? Okay. okay, very good. No problem, no problem, Luciana. Yes, ya lo tienes, perfect. Now, let's see. In the Teacher, other part, we are going to... Pregunta. Yes. Vamos a dibujar solamente un rostro con, con, con pelo o vamos a dibujar todo un cuerpo? Depende de ti, como, como prefieras, okay? Yeah. Now, you're welcome. You're welcome, Fabri Francisco. Now I'm going to talk about someone else. Yeah. Y ahora aquí, I'm going to draw, I'm going to talk about some, someone else. Voy a hablar de otra friend. Okay. This is my friend. Aquí también voy a hablar de otro friend. En este caso, I'm going to talk about a girlfriend. Okay. I'm going to draw here a girlfriend. Oh, sorry about my fear of lies. Oh, dear. Sí, 
teacher, mmm, yo no he escribido nada, pero no te puedo escribir. Yes, ahí vas a hablar acerca de tus friends, de cualquiera que sea tu friend, ¿ya? No problem. I'm going to throw here this. Ah, look now. I'm throwing another friend. Oh, sorry. And that's it. One moment, please. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now this is my other friend. And that's it. Yeah. I'm gonna I'm I'm drawing here. No, this is my friend. I'm gonna write the name here. No, this is my friend, for example, Carla. Okay, this is my friend Carla. Now I'm talking about a girlfriend. I have to say here she, ¿verdad? Recuerda que si hablo de un boy, digo he. Pero si hablo de una girl, diré she. Right? Now I'm going to write here. She has, for example, she has brown eyes. And that's it. That's the answer for her. Right? Now I'm talking about those two friends. Yeah? Ok, recuerden, ustedes pueden hablar, eh, yo estoy poniendo allí solamente como example, ya como ejemplo. Ustedes pueden hablar de, de, de otros amigos que ustedes tienen, ¿no? De pronto por ahí alguien me puede decir, yo tengo a mi amigo, esto, Peter. Teacher, ¿puedes ¿Ya? atrás? ¿Cómo, Kate? Puede ser un friend del colegio también. Yes, puedes dibujar a tu friend del colegio. De pronto deseas dibujar en a Jelly, o a Luciana, o a Dylan, o a Gonzalo. Eso depende de ti, ¿ok? Puedes dibujar okay, a tu friend sure. del school también, ¿ya? Ok, you've got here two minutes, two minutes to do this activity. I'm going to stop the recording option. Well, students, we're going to talk about homes. This is the unit number six. Here we have a tree house. You know what is a tree house? Es una casa en el tree. Okay, en el árbol, en el tree. This is a tree house, right? Look at the photo. What can you see? We can see a tree house and it's in the jungle, right? It's in the woods. That's beautiful. Look. This house has a balcony. Oh, oh, beautiful. It has windows. Look, windows. It has doors, a big door, right? Mm -hmm. And that's interesting, no? It's made by wood. Now, it's a wooden house. Let's see. I'm going to go to this part. Oh, here we have the lesson one. We have here some words, okay? So let's do this. Lesson one, words. Activity one, listen and point, okay? We're gonna listen and we're gonna point on this part about the words, the new words, okay? We're gonna listen and point, remember. Vamos a escuchar y vamos a apuntar o vamos a señalar, okay? Pay attention. That's the first part, activity one. Bathroom, bedroom, kitchen, living room, bed, cabinet, shower, TV. Ok, 
Now we have here uh, the next activity. Activity two, listen and repeat. Okay, this is page number 58, right? No 57. This is 58. Now we're gonna listen and repeat now. Pay attention. Bathroom. 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 Bedroom. 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 Kitchen. 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 Living room. Living room. Living room. Living room. Bed. 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 Cabinet. 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 Shower. 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 TV. 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 Okay. Well, students, in this part, we have some parts of the house, right? Look here. Oh, we have a house, right? Now, you're going to tell me. I'm going to ask some questions about this house, yeah? You're going to tell me. Uh, the question is going to be, what is it? And you're going to tell me the answer in this way. It's, okay. One moment, please. I'm going to do this. No? The question is going to be, what is it? And you're going to tell me, it's, okay, one moment. It's a, uh, yeah? That's going to be the answer. That's going to be the answer. So now you tell me this part. Okay. Uh, well, what is it, students? What is it? Bed. Okay, bed. tell me complete. It's a... It's bed. Okay, but it's a bed. All of these parts... It's a bed. It's a bed. A bed. It's a bedroom. Oh, it's a bedroom. No, it's just bed. a bedroom. Yeah, it's a bedroom. It's a bedroom. Very good. Now tell me, what is it? It's a kitchen. It's a kitchen. It's a kitchen. Great. Excellent. It's a kitchen. Now tell me please, what is it? It's a bathroom. It's a bathroom. It's a bathroom. Very good, it's a bathroom. Now tell me, what is it? This is a living room. Okay. It's, it's a living room. Excellent. It's, it's a, a living, living room. room. It's a living room. Very good. A it's it's a living room, right? Now tell me, what is it? It's a bed. 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 Excellent. That's correct. It's a bed. Now tell me, please, what is it? It's a TV. It's a TV. It's a TV. A TV. A TV. It's a TV. Great. Now, what is it? It's, it's a shower. It's a shower. It's a shower. Great. Excellent. Now, tell me, what is it? It's a cabinet. It's a cabinet. It's a cabinet. It's a cabinet. Excellent. That's correct. Very good. It's a cabinet. It's a cabinet. It's a cabinet. Great. Excellent. Excellent. Good for you. Good for you. You did it very well until this activity. Yeah. So now let's continue to the next part. Yeah. Let's continue to the next part. Oh, yeah, we are on the unit number 12. Oh, sorry, on the unit number six, right? Unit six. We're on the page number 59. That it's the same for you. Yeah, now let's go to the workbook, students. Ahora sí, vamos a ir a nuestro workbook. 
Okay, let me see what page, what page are we? Oh yeah, this is the page number 43 for me, but for you, this is page number, si no me equivoco para ustedes, es 109, ¿verdad? 109, vamos a nuestro workbook. For you, this is 109. Yes, is that correct? Yeah, are we on this part? Okay, it's a previous class students who are talking or we're doing this activity, right? It says that we have to read and color, no? For example, here it says, uh, he has brown eyes, no? He doesn't have black hair, his hair is brown. So. He has brown eyes, we have to color the eyes with brown, no? So we have to do this. He has brown eyes now, oh dear. That's it, no? Brown eyes. One moment. Yeah. Oh my God, it's too big. Now I think this, brown eyes. Okay, what else? Oh, it's too big, too big. Now it's better. No brown eyes and he doesn't have black hair. His hair is brown. So the brown hair. Oh, it's, it's too big. I think this. Okay. That's it. No? Brown hair. Now let's talk about this girl. She has black hair. Okay, let's color the hair with black, right? She has black hair. So let's color it black. Oh, yes. What else is here? She doesn't have brown eyes. Oh, her eyes are blue. Let's look for the blue color and color the eyes with blue right because she has blue eyes no now let's continue with the next part it says he has brown hair okay the hair is brown color let's color it brown and that's it right he has brown hair and he doesn't have blue eyes his eyes are green. Okay, let's color with green eyes. Okay, green eyes. And that's it. Green eyes. Yeah? His Those are the answers. Are yeah? green. Yes, his eyes are green. Green eyes. His eyes are green. Excellent. That's correct. Now let's go to the next part, students. Here says activity to listen and circle. What do you have to circle here, no? It says, I have two cousins, Carl and Luisa, okay? Number one, Carl is a boy. He, okay. What's the answer in this case? We have to choose between has or doesn't have, no? In este caso, brown hair, the correct answer is he has brown hair okay él tiene brown hair yeah so pay attention please you're gonna listen and circle the correct answer yeah pay attention track 28 unit 5 lesson 4 grammar activity 2 listen and circle i have two cousins carl and louisa one carl is a boy he has brown hair. He doesn't have blue eyes. His eyes are brown. Okay, tell me please, what's the answer here? He has or he doesn't have blue eyes. He has, professor. He has. Okay, listen, huh? Carl and Louisa. One, Carl is a boy. 
He has brown hair. He doesn't have blue eyes. He has or he doesn't have blue eyes? Doesn't have blue eyes. Oh. He doesn't. He doesn't. doesn't. <laughs> He doesn't have blue eyes. ¿Por qué? Porque his eyes are brown. Okay, let's continue. His eyes are brown. Two. Luisa is a girl. She doesn't have brown hair. Okay, Luisa is a girl. She has or she doesn't have brown hair. She doesn't have. Yes. Oh, very good. She doesn't have brown hair. Let's continue. Her hair is black. She doesn't have blue eyes. Okay, she has or she doesn't have blue eyes? She doesn't have blue eyes. Oh, she doesn't she have, have blue eyes. Very good. Next part. She has green eyes. She, she has, has or she doesn't have green eyes? She has. She has. She has. She has green eyes. Excellent. Very good. La siguiente part, students. La siguiente part les va a quedar a ustedes como homework. Yeah? The, la 109, the activity number three. La actividad número tres. ¿Qué es lo que vas a hacer aquí en la actividad número, número tres? Te dice, ¿no? Eh, read and write and draw and color. Vas a leer y vas a tener que escribir. Vas a completar aquí en la parte inferior. Y luego vas a tener que colorear, perdón, dibujar y colorear. ¿no? For example, aquí muy parecido a lo que hicimos hace un rato. ¿no? Vas a hablar de un friend, de un amigo o amiga. This is my friend Ricardo, for example. ¿no? Y luego aquí indicar. Por ejemplo, puedes indicar el color de su cabello. ¿no? He has brown hair. Y dibujas aquí con el cabello de color brown, ¿no? Luego aquí dice, this is my friend, ¿no? Aquí vas a hablar de otro amigo o amiga, ¿no? For example, this is my friend. Este es mi amigo o mi amiga. For example, eh, Karen, ¿ok? This is my friend Karen. And she has, for example, blue eyes. Ella tiene blue eyes. Entonces dibujas a Karen here y con sus blue eyes, ¿ya? Entonces, ¿cómo? No te escucho, Alejandro. No, vas a dibujar y vas a colorear y vas a hablar de dos amigos aquí. Pueden ser varones o pueden ser mujeres o puede ser un varón y una mujer. Puede ser algún amigo, algún amigo de, del barrio, sí. Puede ser algún amigo del colegio, también. Cualquier amigo, ¿ok? Vamos, la siguiente part les voy a dejar otro homework más. I'm going to do something here, one moment. Esto es la 109, activity 3. Vamos a la siguiente part. Ya, yeah. this is the other homework. 110. También la 110 les va a quedar como homework. ¿Qué vas a hacer aquí? ¿No? Eh, la primera parte está recontra sencillo, pues, de este homework, ¿no? Eh, ¿Qué te dice? Trace and write. Aquí vas a delinear, ¿no? Vas a delinear, ¿ya? Y luego vas a escribir aquí. O sea, letter Q, R, S, T, U, ¿ok? Cualquiera de, eh, bueno, todas estas las vas a delinear y luego vas a escribir una más aquí, ¿ok? Luego, ¿qué más vas a hacer? Te dice activity to match. Aquí vas a relacionar. The capital letter, la mayúscula con the lowercase con la minúscula, ¿no? Luego te dice activity three, write, vas a escribir. Aquí tienes the capital letter y vas a escribir the lowercase, la minúscula. Tienes la mayúscula, escribes la minúscula, ¿ya? Ahora viene la siguiente parte. Esto, la activity four, esto no lo van a hacer, ¿ya? ¿Por qué? Porque este es un listening. Este listening lo vamos a trabajar aquí la próxima clase, ¿ok? Así que... Esta no la vas a hacer. Ya este es un audio que lo vamos a trabajar en clase. Entonces sería the, the page number 110, la 110. Vas a desarrollar las actividades, ya. Eh, uno, dos y tres. Ok. Vamos a la siguiente. ¿Qué más te voy a dejar como homework el día de hoy? Esta página de aquí. 
¿ya? Esto es acerca del value. ¿Se acuerdan del value, del valor que hemos aprendido anteriormente? ¿Ya? El valor de be active, de, de estar en movimiento, de ser activos, ¿verdad? De no quedarnos sentados, tal vez solamente con el teléfono, la computadora, aquí. ¿Se acuerdan? En, el, en esta canción aprendimos este valor, ¿verdad? Be active, estar en movimiento, moverte, correr, saltar, brincar. Right, mover la cabeza, ¿no? Arriba, abajo, etcétera. Be active y realizar actividades que te eh, ayuden a estar active, a estar activo, ¿ya? Entonces, this is the page 111, ¿verdad? Esta es la página 111, vamos a escribirla aquí, ¿ya? ¿Qué vas a hacer aquí? Dice, who's active? Look and check. Vas a ver quién de estos personajes está poniendo en práctica este valor de be active, de ser activo. Por ejemplo, el number one le pusieron un check, claro, ¿no? Estás en movimiento aquí cuando haces ciclismo. El number two, ¿estará poniendo en práctica el valor de be active? Number three, number four, a los que están poniendo en práctica el valor de be active, pones el check, ¿ya? Luego dice activity to read and draw. ¿Qué vas a hacer en la actividad to? You're going to draw, I'm active. Dice, estoy siendo activo. Estoy poniendo en práctica el valor del be active. Te vas a dibujar a ti mismo realizando una acción donde pongas en práctica el valor de be active, ¿no? ¿Ok? Te puedes dibujar a ti mismo manejando bicicleta, saltando, corriendo, trepando, jugando algún deporte, etc. Ya cualquiera donde demuestres que estás poniendo en práctica el valor de be active. ¿Ya? Y eso es todo lo que van a tener que hacer students, ¿ya? Until this part, until this part, ¿ya? 109, 110, and 111, ¿ya? Well, students, we are in the last part of our class. I just want to say thank you very much. That's all for today, and see you the next class, ¿ok? That's all, students. Bye-bye.